Hey, this is Manny Fresh for another tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to share your phone's LTE data with your computer so you could access the internet on your computer. Or basically, how to tether your phone to your computer. I have an iPhone XR with T Mobile service, and there's two ways you could connect your phone to your computer, and that's via USB or wireless first method I'm going to show you is via USB so you need to go ahead and grab your lightning cable and connect it from your computer USB ports to your phone and also I suggest you download iTunes because you're gonna need that too and as of this video I have iTunes 12.10 and the reason why you need iTunes if you're planning to use it your phone with the lightning cable then iTunes provides the set of drivers that you need in order for it to work so once you download iTunes once you have your phone connected then what you want to do is you want to go over to settings and then you want to go to personal hotspot and again once you connect the phone to your computer make sure you trust the computer all right so right where it says allow others to join if yours is not green go ahead and switch it to green and once if you have the cable connected it's going to recognize that automatically so if you go to control panel and then you go to network and internet network and sharing center and then if you go to change adapter settings you want to make sure that you have this Ethernet adapter called Apple Mobile Device Ethernet. Uh, this one is my regular Ethernet connection, which is not connected. This is my wireless, and this is the one for Apple. So if you don't see that, then make sure that, again, iTunes is installed. Make sure your cable is not broken. So I would suggest trying a different cable until you see here on the network connections, the Apple mobile device. So mine says Ethernet 3. So if I double click, it says I got internet. If I go to details, it gives me my local IP address. So I should be ready to go. And I could confirm that by going over to speedtest.net. You don't have to do this. But if I go to speedtest.net, you could see here that I'm connected to a T-Mobile server. All right, so that's how you do it with the USB cable. The next way on how to do it would be via wireless. And with the wireless, you don't need iTunes. So first thing you need to do on your phone is you need to go over back to general and then about. And keep an eye on that name it says iPhone that is something you need to know so once you go back to the personal hotspot what you want to do is if you have the cable connected to your computer I suggest disconnecting the cable or if you want to go ahead and just connect it via Wi-Fi go back to your network settings and I'm already connected with the cable, but I'm gonna show you how to connect it via Wi-Fi too. So what you wanna do is on the list of networks is you wanna go to the one called iPhone and that's the name of your phone. So basically once you enable the hotspot, your computer should pick up your hotspot, which is the, the iPhone name. So you wanna click that. You could uncheck that if you want to. And then you hit connect and then the security key here is whatever you see on the Wi-Fi password now I've learned that if the default one one two three four five six seven eight doesn't work I suggest you changing the key to something else so I'm just gonna type in here what I have then click next Do you want to allow your PC to be discoverable no and then it says I'm connected. I'm gonna disconnect the phone. So that way it, it remains on the white on the Wi-Fi. So if I go back to speedtest.net, uh, 
I'm gonna confirm again that I'm connected to T-Mobile. And again, the speeds are not great. I got one bar where I live at, so I'll probably get like a couple of megabytes. But if you have an internet outage, this definitely works if you need to access websites right away. All right, guys, so this is how you tether your phone with your computer. If you have any questions and issues, leave your comment below. Thank you for watching and please subscribe to my channel.